Welcome back to yet another Star Stable video. As always, please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, as it truly does make my day. And today, we have new Wild Woods quests with Subi, Sahar, and also the tribes. So let's get right into it then. And I post new Star Stable videos every single day. And I also have an open 500 Star Queen giveaway on my channel. If you want to enter, just click the link that the pinned comment has down below. And yeah, let's get into the video. Then. Guys, this is Epona unlocking level fancy. My squirrels have been trying to find you for ages. Where are you? Come to me ASAP. We're in need of your help. Rendezvous with the spy master in his hideout. This is 20 experience. That's so good. That's so good. Oh my goodness. I really need to quest more, don't I? Alright, let's go to the spy master in his little rendezvous. I think that's the Veildale man who lives in a cave, so... We're gonna go off of that. I have my little fox friend to help with the questing, which is just lovely. Okay, do I have quests on? I do. Look, he lives in a cave on the side of the road. This is a beautiful house. Beautiful, guys. Very beautiful. <laughs> Nothing less. Alright, let's skizzle on over there then and meet him. Okay, well, my plan worked. Kind of just run into the green arrow. And it did work. Oh my gosh, did he get an update? No, 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 he didn't. His wig is still crusty. You've arrived. Thank Aideen. I can finally fill you in on the most recent events. We have a situation unfolding at Wildwoods, which requires your attention. Consider the spy master's plan. One of our druid agents, Sahar, has gone missing while exploring the wild woods. She was sent on a secret mission to locate a site with great magical power. We haven't heard her since her departure, nor have we seen her horse. Lucien is worried about her fate, but I have assumed her him that Sahar is strong in mind and spirit. For everyone's safety, the squirrel spies and I must remain hidden in the shadows. We cannot reveal ourselves by searching for her. That's why we need help. What do you want me to do? Sahar was spotted um, near Fairgrove by our superior spies. And how will I recognize her? She rides a rune runner and travels with her pet owl. I should leave now. Um, if you don't feel like riding over there, you may take the transport. Do you see the carriage over there? It is not as the comfortable as the more, shall we say, modern counterpart, but it will transport you there quickly, and time is of the essence. Okay, there's a carriage? What? The carriage is all the way in Firgrove. Okay, well, we're taking the carriage, then. What? This is the modern counterpart. What? Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna pay. I, I don't really care. 25 gorvik shillings, I got you. I'll cover that cost. Since you can't loan me some for the carriage. Conditions fulfilled. Did I take the carriage? I'm so concerned. What is that? Okay, I think we need to go to the entry of Wild Woods over here because this is a very risky place that only us the chosen ones can take. Here's the path. I'm I'm gonna follow it into Wild Woods. Great. Hoof prints made by an unshod horse. Unshod? Is that a feather? Yes, there are definitely owl feathers here. More hoof prints. That is very exciting, guys. Wow. Very exciting. I really hope I find Sahar up ahead. I haven't been here since, like, the quest here. <laughs> I haven't been here. I don't... I don't know, what's this? Another two-legger come to trespass our land. Suppose you are looking for the giant squirrel on a horse. She rode past here, but Ash apprehended her and took her to the ancient Colosseum. Ash knows how to take care of dangerous outsiders. I thought that guy would recognize us, because didn't we have a quest before, best daylight? With this guy over here, we had a whole entire questing line with that man. With that horse, I mean. But he doesn't recognize us. We're just a dangerous outsider. Oh, great. Right. All right, I see what I see it. Confrontation in the arena. Oh my goodness, it's Sahar and the Rune Runner that I didn't get yet. You know, maybe I could just steal her, snatch it, snatch her Rune Runner and be like, you know what, this is mine now. It was always meant to be mine and no one will know because 
No other NPC has the Rune Runner, so I mean, no one will know. No one will know it's us, because we're meant to have it. I just don't want to train for it. There's a moose, it's coming to attack. What do you do with these intruders? Our peace has been disturbed. Hairless squirrels will be taught not to provoke the warriors. Are you with this outsider? Do you know what she has done? She has stolen our vases and probably broken them too. She is yet another example of why two leaguers should never be trusted. We warriors are ready to protect wild woods from her ilk, and you will soon see that we deliver on that claim. What is going on there? Are these horses talking? Are you hearing this as well? This took me from my horrors. I meant no harm, honestly. Oh, Sahar, it's okay. I'm a friend. Silence. She has brought blight to the forest and unease to the herds, and she trampled the flower beds with her flaming horse. There are flaming hoof prints to prove it. Flaming hoof prints? Okay, are you serious? Have you seen my horrors? Ash, look, she rides a rune runner. We druids are in tune with Aiden's gift. We never bring destruction. Druids have merely adopted Aiden's gift. We herds here choose long before you humans for the- okay. Um, now tell me, what have you done with our vases? What? What are you even talking about? Vases? Like, for flowers? <laughs> I'm too confused by this ridiculous line of questioning to even be afraid of you anymore. Do not mock me. There are our ceremonial vases. My patient runs short. I do not have what you're looking for, and I haven't done anything wrong. Maybe try looking for evidence instead of just blaming the stranger. Mm-hmm. Let's take a deep breath. Best Oh, let's take a deep breath. Yes, well, this isn't over. <gasps> I don't know your name, but thanks for helping me, I guess. Um, okay. If this two-legger didn't steal our vases, it must be Ziggy. He's always up to no good. No one from the herds could ever have created this chaos. You hairless squirrels have interfered with our business, so you should deal with this. Margaret, we saw a horse with a rider. We assumed it was- Oh my gosh, wait. Is it the Dark Rider? Oh my gosh, are things just getting a little spicy now? Because doesn't the Dark Rider like... I remember the Dark Rider having flaming horseshoes at the beginning of the game when they were stealing the paper files and they fired them up because of the flaming horse. You know, so I think it's a Dark Rider and that's why there was like Sabine. So it's probably Sabine. Oh no, it's little rock star Sabine at it again. Crazy little rock star Sabine. Okay, where are the hoof prints? Over here. Gotta follow them. The hoof are like so far apart. This must be like one huge horse with skinny legs. <laughs> like what? What? Like look. It's just a very tall horse with very small horse shoes, you know? And that is what this type of horse is. Don't ask how I know. I'm just like an export. I'm an export. <laughs> No, yeah, I'm an export of your files, you know? No, I'm literally an expert at this stuff, so don't ask how I know how that breed of horse is, but I just know, you know, I just know. Okay. Hey, I only took a few vases, nothing else. You have to listen to me. I took some vases because I needed something to put my acorns in. I didn't mean to do bad. The warriors are always breaking the vases anywhere, so I thought they wouldn't notice if I took one or three. The adults are always blaming me. They are so angry. I ran away when I heard that they were going to capture the two-legger that came to Wildwoods. But Ziggy knows better, better than they do, because I'm a superior spy. I saw ugly squirrels running around and messing places up, so I followed them. I saw the nest where they were taking their trophies. You should go see it. Then you can be- Oh my gosh. His eyes are like staring into my soul right now. This man is cute. This- No. Ew. It's like- it's so creepy. I no. <laughs> is this a glitch? It's eyes. Uh, Ziggy, are you alright? Where's the nest? Take this path. It's literally so creepy. I can't. Ziggy. <laughs> what is that? Look, your eyes are normal here. Your eyes are a little bit um I mean I'm not judging, but I'm like judging. <laughs> you know. Okay, let me gather your stuff for you like a freaking servant i am real quick and um uh yeah that'll be good hoof prints these must be ziggies little trees 
acorns. There was literally trees there, so, you know, it could have just been the trees. I'll cross the water here. All right. <laughs> I will. More acorns by the tunnel. That is literally trees. It could have just fallen there. Here's the tree stump. The nest can't be far. Oh my gosh, it's a gremlin. It's a gremlin paradise. Why are there gremlins? These little gremlins are the Christmas helpers. So I'm not mad. Look, the moose, the moose just knows everything. It's leading us everywhere. Okay, where's the gremlins? Oh, it's down there. Okay. Okay, I know what I'm doing. All right. This is a bunch of stuff here stolen from the herds. So these little creatures are the culprits. Let's go back and tell everyone. They're stealing everything. I literally thought it was Sabine though. Because why else would there be flaming hoof prints? Nothing else. I'm telling you guys. Sabine isn't in these quests. Messy it up a little bit. Okay, guys. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. Someone's arrived. I discovered a nest made by the small squeak creatures. He did but take a few bases. It's good that you got to the bottom of this and cleared the geese involvement in it. These small creatures you've referred to are caprans. While it's not uncommon for them to be spotted in the winter time, they only have recently been sighting here at Wildwoods. Here, one we oh <laughs> Um, Caprans are drawn to places of magic, and since we have seen many strange things down here lately, it's not surprising that these creatures have shown up. And that's good, you have an explanation. Small creatures are not the cause and only symptom of chaotic energy. Some things you should know about the sentinel tree. Margaret, there is something far more sinister at play here than it seemed. Oh, but there's an influx of Pandorian energy. Oh my, wait, there's literally a flying nest of crusty brambles. We worry it might be causing the unease among the herds and disrupting the balance of nature. And those flaming hoof prints, definitely not made by the druid Sahar's horse or Ziggy. The humans with the flaming horse have been seen by us many times, but only from a distance. There's something else. Some other force has awakened this corruption. Now that we are aware of the corruption too near the sentinel tree, we need to come together and build a shrine to appeal to the agent forces of the tree. This is the only way to appeal to it. I have an idea on how to solve. There is an ancient place of great positive power here in Wildwoods, but we've only heard rumors about it. So you know about that too. That's the very place I came looking for. Hey Margaret, I'll set a marker on the map and you can go ahead and explore. We'll be like right behind you, even though I know the place, you know, look, we're like right behind you. I don't know why I gave her that voice, but like with her, what she says, it just fits in so good. Okay, here we go. We're going to find this little place of positive energy. Surprised it's not myself. Okay, let's go over here. Oh, is it the man that sells horses? Is he the pot? I was literally about to make it to the ground. No, I'm surprised. I thought you were the positive energy. I have to go up there. Excuse you. Like... I see this little bramble here. I can go. Okay. Okay. Thank you for finally showing me some appreciation. It is as I fear this runestone has been broken and its pieces are shattered. The runestone split into pieces like this. There's no wonder we feel the imbalance in the woods. This is why we drew the sot in wild woods. Once we sense the imbalance, there are darker forces here than Caprans running around in these woods. Only with the unifying power of the stone and druidic shrine can we restore things to their natural balance. This will stop the Caprans from coming into the woods and causing mischief. They are drawn to these strange energies. No, this is my secret house. Why are you here, bestie? Now that you understand the role of the runestone in restoring balance to wild woods, you may have guessed how you can help us. The power of the runestone will remain diminished until we make it whole again. I need to find the missing pieces. That is what we know. The warriors saw Ryder. They thought it to be me, but it was before I even entered Wildwoods. Now there is discord, bad energy, and a broken runestone. I suspect that Ryder carried off a fragment of this runestone. If you are right, would that explain the imbalance in Wildwoods? The help of the mystics and foresters, we can solve everything. Yes. Now let me go off while everyone else stays behind and solve everything for everyone. Oh my gosh, there was a little passage there. I, I was- I took the risky way and it, it was right there. The passage was literally right there. Okay, let's see. Oh, a piece of the stone. Whoa, it's really heavy. I know, that's- that's why I could fit it in my pocket, guys. You know? 
another piece of the stone. But didn't they say someone ran off with a piece? How will we find that one, Busty? We need to find the stealer real quick. I forgot there were like animals that walk around this place. I can feel the strange energy. This, like not gonna lie, I think I haven't ever seen this area before, this quest. Amazing, you've collected all the pieces. Help Sahar build the shrine. I brought the acorns as a tribute. Brought them in a warrior's vase. Aziki, of course, welcome. It rebuilt itself. And there's a flamer. There, Aideen has accepted our gift and bestowed her restorative power on this rune stone. Oh my gosh, I thought they were ending it there. I was like, no, stay human. You are welcome at our gathering. The herds gathered. Oh my gosh. This is like a warrior cat's right out of the book. I can't. We herds traditionally live separate lives. It is now we maintain peace. Why don't I make tea to celebrate? As I was saying, we worked in harmony to save wild woods. Our two-legged friends have done much for us. This is a very happy occasion. Ash, why do you insist that all these qualities only belong to warriors? Especially today, have we not all shown courage? Yes, little sister. It is still hard to run without you, but I suppose today showed me your quiet strength. Thanks, big sis. Now, our new friends have many fine attributes and are special to all of the herds. Thank you. May the light of Aideen shine on you all herds, and let us take our efforts can repel the dark forces. <gasps> it's an evil man. I mean woman, sorry. Look, you can see her wig shivering from over here. <laughs> okay. Wait, we're being watched. Where is she? Can't I can't see her. She's up there somewhere. She's watching us. It's kind of creepy. Thank you, human. Wait, are your help? The herds are closer to each other than they ever were today let's go on an adventure talk to sahar you came to rescue me back in time how did you know my name the spy master sent me you should check in with him i will he'll be glad to hear of today's events we couldn't have accomplished anything without you i want to give you the jacket to remember our adventure and our new friendship i hope you wear it with pride that's so kind i love how you're carrying around free jackets for me thanks for the help and i hope we'll meet again that's it but what about- what? That's it? No, what? They left us on a cliffhanger with that little cut scene. They better continue this. Wait, can we find her? Is she still up here? Okay, that's way too steep. No way. But that looks like it's actually the end of the quests, which I'm quite surprised Star Stable would leave us on such a cliffhanger. They only gave us that little cut scene with her and then called it a day, basically. Okay. Can we go up here? I just noticed. No, I really want to, I really want to find Sabine. If you know how to find Sabine, let me know in the comments, you know, after that cutscene, if she's moved or anything like that. And this is the jacket we have. And in case you're curious, it is the embroidered, embellished rude jacket. Make a magical impression in the gift from Sahar that celebrates your first adventure and the power of friendship. Wear and think fondly of the herds and wild woods. It has riding plus eight, jumping plus one, and command plus four. And you could like zoom in and that is so cute. It's like one of the Celtic um jackets in the game, except it's a purplish, kind of burgundy, but also pink color. So I hope that illustrates it for you or paints a picture. But yeah, that is basically all of the quests that has come out so far. Someone just zoomed away in the background. Love that. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and bye everyone. Thank you so much for watching the Star Stable video. As always, please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already as I post new Star Stable videos every single day. I also currently have an open 500 star coin giveaway so you can check my channel. It's like from three days ago. I'll have a pinned comment with it probably. But yeah, join that and thank you so much for watching. Bye! <laughs>